Welcome to Jason on English. Let's look at using articles. Single countable nouns. What are articles? Articles are the words a, an, and the. Articles are sometimes used with nouns. Sometimes we don't use articles with nouns, but you can often find articles with nouns. In this lesson, we will look at single countable nouns only. Plural countable nouns and uncountable nouns will be covered in another lesson. A and an. You can remember the basic meaning of these articles by thinking of the number one. I have one banana. I have a banana. I have one apple. I have an apple. Basically, a and an mean single. I have a banana. I have an apple. I have one. The articles a and an can be used with single countable nouns. Pronunciation. Some nouns begin with vowels. A, E, I, O, U. These nouns need the article an for smooth pronunciation. An apple. An egg. An igloo. An omelette. An umbrella. If I say a apple, a egg, a igloo, a omelette, a umbrella, it doesn't sound smooth. So we use an for words like this. An apple, an egg, an igloo, an omelette, an umbrella. You try. An apple. An egg. An igloo. An omelette. An umbrella. Nouns that do not begin with vowels use a, a banana, a penguin. The letter U has two sounds, so be careful. An umbrella, umbrella, a, a, a vowel sound, an umbrella. A ukulele, ukulele, u, u. Not a vowel sound, a ukulele. Should you use a or an? Let's try a little test. Alligator, alligator. An alligator. Watermelon, watermelon. A watermelon. Uniform. Uniform. A uniform. Helicopter. Helicopter. A helicopter. When you're choosing between a or an, you have to hear the word. This is a pronunciation problem. If you look at the word and you see, for example, the letter U, and you think, U, an, an umbrella. Yes, U needs an. You might have some problems. The sound is different when you say uniform. Uniform doesn't need an. Uniform needs a. When you're choosing between a or an, remember you have to hear the word, not see the word. How to use the. One rule to remember is that a and an are used for general nouns, but the is used for nouns that are specific. Specific means the noun is special, it's clear, it's different from a general noun because there's more information. I saw a cat. This is very general. 
We have no information about what kind of cat. I saw the cat that lives with my neighbor. This cat is more specific. This cat is special. The cat. He showed me a new car. Mm, this is also general. A new car. Which car? He showed me the new car that he bought last week. Now I understand. He bought the car last week. This is specific. If the sentence has specific information, it's better to use the. Which article? Let's try another test. Bob ate hamburger for lunch. Bob ate hamburger for lunch. Bob ate a hamburger for lunch. The word hamburger has no special information. It's very general. Jim dropped hamburger that he bought for his son. Jim dropped hamburger that he bought for his son. Jim dropped the hamburger that he bought for his son. Well, this hamburger is special. It's specific. He bought for his son. Ann bought new strap for bag that her mother gave her. Ann bought new strap for bag that her mother gave her. Ann bought a new strap for the bag that her mother gave her. In this sentence, strap is general. We have no special information about this strap. But bag is very specific. Her mother gave her. In this case, we need a new strap and the bag. One last rule to think about. The first time you use nouns in longer stories, you should use a or an. After that, you can use the. I saw a young boy. The boy had a big dog. The dog chased a cat. The cat ran up a tree. This is a longer story with a lot of nouns. The first sentence, I saw a young boy. This is the first time using boy. We should use a. The boy had a big dog. This is the second time using boy. We should use the. But it's the first time using dog. We should use a. The dog chased a cat. Well, this is the second time using dog. So the is okay. But it's the first time using cat. We should use a. The cat ran up a tree. This is the second time using cat. We should use the. And it's the first time using tree. We should use a. These sentences have no specific information about the boy, the dog, the cat, the tree. If there's specific information, like young boy that lives next to me, well, that sentence we should have the, because that word, boy, is more specific. In this example, boy is general. If you like, please watch the video again and practice using a, an, and the when you speak. Thank you for watching.